honestly thought I was not gonna get these. I actually wanted these from sneakers and it took a while to come in. I honestly thought it, would, it got stolen and that was not gonna be the first time, to be honest. But they're here anyways. Today guys, we have the Air Jordan 5, DJ Khaled, We The Best, Crimson Bliss. What's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. This thing is Chris. I'm back here with another video for you guys today. And of course we have an on foot submission tune in throughout the whole video so you guys can see how these look on foot. But besides that, before we dive in straight into this video, I just want to say that I thank you guys for stopping by and watching this video. It comes a long way. So if you guys enjoyed this video, enjoy the channel, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Join the family if you haven't yet. Um, if you want to stay connected with me, my socials will be on the screen and down below in the description box. I do have my own clone brand, so if you guys want to follow that, a support will come a long way. The Instagram is tap 305 website www.tapit305.com and as of right now you guys will be seeing what I do have in store for the clothing brand but besides that let's dive in straight into these we the best boy Alright guys, so start with the box as we always do. And if you already know me, you already know I love a special box. I love a nice looking box. And then just look at this box just from, look at this box. You know, we have like a clear part with a lot of, the clear part has most of the um, designs. You can see at the top it says we the best. Oh. You can see at the top it says we the best right here. And you have some MJ logos going all around. You have in the back, keep going right here MJ logo we have another we the best MJ logo I think that detail is pretty nice I like it and then after that you have the regular box with the like a Jordan 5 box with the lid in black and then you have kind of like um the shoe color like all the like like a um ombre of the all the colors of the shoe within within the jump man you feel me and then after that you have the Nike same color as the jump man and where your label is at, right here. I'm gonna insert a screenshot so you guys can see the label a little clearer. Then after that, the bottom part of the box is basically the color of the shoe as well. You open the box, you kind you kind of have the color of the shoe as well, like a mixture of it, like an ombre mixture of it. And then you have the paper wrapping, and then you should have the shoe itself in there. Now that we're done with the box, let's jump straight into the shoe and talk about some details. So these originally released November 28th. We've seen how Khaled has been hyping this release up for a while now. He's been just posting on his Instagram, posting on social media all over the place about this color and the other colors that he had um, in place to release. promote something and get it out there give it to DJ Khaled because he's gonna do his best work and that's what he did for these and honestly another thing he did as well for these he had like a um on sneakers he had like a release or early release and where um locals in Miami was able to get these and he had like a um meet and greet I'll say in Miami he even signed some of the release pair that locals won and took some pictures with the locals look um sadly I did not win um that release um and I didn't have a chance to go to the um meet up in Miami to to get to get him to sign these or to take a picture it'll be nice to have him sign these Maybe one day you never know I'm, i just might get a chance to meet him and have him sign them anyway but besides that let's get straight to the point these are actually nice in person i do like the fact that um we have some type of premium quality um look into this jordan 5 of course i'm not surprised it came with jo um dj Khaled. of course um let's dive in straight into the color the whole upper of the shoe you have that crimson bliss um colorway which is like a pinkish i'll say a pinkish um pinkish um peach colorway and then you have some hits of blue as you guys can see on the teeth on the midsole right here um that little light blue with the speckle of black and you have more blue in the end the the sock liner and the insole and that's um even the material in there is different the sock liner and the insole you guys can see the material the stitching is um 
totally different we have like a premium look and I do like I do like that about that behind the tongue you have going and the other pair if you put them together it should say keep going like it says on the box if you keep looking on the inside the inside it says we the best in the insole on this pair this is the left pair it says we the best inside and then on the right pair it says Nike Air inside you know it's pretty nice detail like I said again if you go to the back of your heel you have Nike Air on the right pair and then on the left pair yeah, I'm just making sure I'm saying the right <laughs> on the on the left pair on the back of the heel you have we the best stitched up and that nice light blue which looks pretty nice that hit of light blue looks pretty nice and then besides that you have the material of the shoe a leather material I would say honestly I feel like the toe box area could have been a little better I'm not sure if you guys could tell and um through the camera but I feel like for a premium release for like we the best it could have been a little better I feel like it's very soft soft and it's gonna this material gonna get um creased very very easily um if you wear it a lot But besides that, you have the uh, the nets on the side, like your usual Jordan 5. You have the lace lock right here. Um, on this side, it says Nike. I'm not sure if you guys could tell. You have the Jumpman in black right here. And you have your tongue, of course. A little reflective tongue. If you have some uh, lighting, you have some of your midsole in black going in the back. You have the rest of your midsole in a cell colorway. And then going all the way to the outsole, you have the outsole in a creamy cell colorway. And then you have Nike right here in white. And then you can see Jumpman right here. And I believe it's the light blue colorway. You can see the Jumpman. And on this pair, you can see the We The Best on this pair. You know, like I said, the details are incredible. I do love the uh, detail, like a very good detailed shoe. And that's one of the reasons why these are going to be pretty good in my collection. I would say if you're a collector, collect these. Um, If I have a chance to get all, um, all the other pairs, I will definitely go and get them because... It's worth putting in my collection, you know. I always wanted some type of DJ Khaled shoes, but obviously it was very hard to get. And was once these, was these, was these was rumored to drop, I was like, yeah, I gotta try my my best to get at least one of them. And we got lucky with these, you know. into the shoe you have the laces in the crimson colorway but if you want to add some little flair you could change up the um the laces and these three different colorways you could put a black or you could put a light blue black black light blue and then you have like a cell um colorway laces so if you want to switch it up you could go ahead i think it's gonna look pretty good with the blue or the cell comment below which one you think is gonna look pretty nice with i think the black should be fine but again the way it is with the crimson already it looks nice but with these two it's gonna be a different hit of flair into it a little add-on and i think it's gonna look nice look of the Jordan 5 we the best DJ Khaled Crimson Bliss tell me what you guys think in the comments below give me a rating tell me how you guys feel did you guys went for these um do you honestly feel like it's worth it 
and in my opinion i'll start first i'll definitely say i'll give these a nine um to be honest i wouldn't say i'm a crazy fan of the colorway that crimson colorway but again it is a good shoe my only my only bad take about the shoe is the fact the way the um the toe box feel i feel like i don't really like my shoes to crease as much and i feel like these are gonna get creased now that we're done with rating let's dive in straight into size in case you guys never had a jordan 5 before and don't know what size to go for and honestly i'll say you can go through the size with your regular jordans um you should be good but besides that that's pretty much it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did do not forget to like 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 comment subscribe join the family we on the road to 4k and we almost there um thank you guys for all the love and support you guys been giving me it's sneakers and chris i'm out i'll catch you guys in the next one